Hey, what's up everyone? Welcome back to Nicole, of course, as you guys can see from down in the title. Today, I am going to be organizing our laundry room. I've been trying to work on, you know, organizing little bits and pieces of the house while Dalvin is gone and in Milwaukee visiting his friends. So I have some, you know, time to organize and knock out videos. Basically, I really hope you guys will enjoy these organization videos because I like doing them a lot. So let's get started. I went ahead and bought these Ross bins. Um, I showed you them in a different video, but I don't know which one is coming out first because I stacked up so many that I haven't even edited them yet. I'm kind of editing them as I put them out. So um, probably tomorrow I'm going to edit a couple so that I have them all scheduled for you know each day so I might have talked about these in a different video that may or may not be out already but I got these from Ross they are three different sizes small medium and large the large was $5.99 $4.99 and then I think this is $3.99 let me see yep $3.99 so Ross, I was going to use these in my um, under the sink organization video, but I think I'm going to use them here in the laundry room. I'm not totally sure yet. I'm kind of just going with the flow and seeing how everything fits and looks. So I also bought two jars, which I use these under the sink as well, and I like how they looked and how they display things. So, actually I think the one I bought for the kitchen was a little bit smaller because I think the price on that was $2.99. These are $3.99, but that's okay because they look exactly the same. I just think that the other one is oval shape rather than square. So they do come with this little plastic on top just, just to protect the lid from getting scratched up. So it's just a nice silver lid and this is glass. So I'm gonna be putting um, like these things in here and then I have another one which I think I'm gonna put these little um, pods for laundry in one of them as well. So yeah, I'm kind of just going as I do the video basically I didn't like plan anything out and then I talked about these in a mukbang that I just did I literally just got done doing it but again I don't know when that's coming out so <laughs> yeah just work with me okay so these are from Bed Bath and & Beyond and the whole store is going out of sale so I got these 30% off for both of them they were 20 bucks um, I didn't know if I had room in here to use them. If not, I think I'm going to put them in the closet, which I'm going to be doing an organization video on that as well. The handle is right here, but if they don't work in the closet, then I'm going to have to <laughs> find a different place for them, but I couldn't pass them up because they're just a, such a good deal going on for two huge large bins for 20 bucks so um, I'm gonna see how that works out first thing I want to do is open up the other jar take this plastic off and I should really actually clean these out like wipe them down and wash them but just for the video right now, I'm going to leave those and then I'm going to cut out or cut off all of the tags from these bins real quick and throw them in the bag. These are so nice and sturdy. I love them so much. I wish they came in uh, different colors, but you know how Ross is, is like hit or miss you find what you can find 
Otherwise, I guess I could try like a TJ Maxx. Don't worry about those things that are flinging off. <laughs> You're probably, they're pro you guys are probably like, oh, wow, she's making a mess. I'm actually about to clean after this, so it's not a big deal. I'm going to pour these scent beads in here. These are only for Dalvin because I cannot use these. They will make me break out and itch. So pour these in here. I can throw this out. See, it just makes everything look nicer and more, you know, organized. Duh. <laughs> now these are mine. I don't use them all the time, but they were on sale, so I just decided to pick them up. They are scent free. So if anyone is has um, like super sensitive skin, I like to use these once in a while. They are all the all brand um, with uh, stain lifter, free, free clear, um, 100 100% free of perfumes and dyes. That's what I have to use because I just break out. I just break out like this huge container is mine, and then those. Scented ones, and then the one up there is Dalvin. I cannot use stuff like that. So, <clears throat> pretty much everything of mine is like bland and plain. And like these are like not the cutest thing on earth. The ones that are you know for his brand they don't usually have like purple in it don't they or something like that but who cares it's just laundry so okay so my plan is to use these and kind of just organize everything that's up here we have some swiffers i'm not sure if you guys can totally see we have some swiffers up there car cleaning um products some um, towels for the cars. Here's the Swiffers. Here's just a random bag um, full of stuff and an umbrella. So I'm going to just probably leave you guys like this so you can see. So I think I'm going to put these dryer sheets. Um, I'm not sure. I was maybe going to put them in here. Let's see. Oh, I might, I might take those out. Excuse me. <clears throat> hmm, I don't know. Let me see. Should I put all the car stuff? in the big bucket or the medium bucket I have some tanning lotion in here hmm. I'm gonna try this Maybe I can put the car stuff in here. Can't reach anything. <laughs> okay, so here's the laundry sheets. I don't know if I'm going to keep those in there. I think I'm going to put my detergent over here, then Dalvin's, then my, I mean his again. I don't know if I should keep that one up there or should I put it in here to make it look more organized. 
I think I'm going to just use this bucket as a cleaning bucket for now on. Oh, but I got to put these here too. So that's not going to work. Nope. Okay, I think I'm going to put these. Should I put these here or should I put them up there? shelf right here rather than just having this hanging rack because I don't use that at all so yeah <laughs> maybe I'll put this like this because I don't use these a lot I use them once in a while put it like that and then maybe behind here like that car stuff. What's behind here? Oh, sponge. <laughs> I forgot to put the rags in here. Can you guys see? Okay. So I have the car stuff in here. I think I'm going to put it like this. And then the towels in there as well. And then the sponge. Then. Oh, but I put it the wrong way. <laughs> I put it the wrong way. I have it facing this way, but the handles are right here. So let me fix this real quick. So this like this, like this. Okay. Like that. You guys see it? looking better it's looking better and organized so hmm I'm not sure if I want to just leave the Swiffers out oh okay. or should I put them in this bin them up but I hope they don't leak will they fit up there even okay I'm gonna have to climb up here <laughs> okay I'm up here now let's do this I don't even know what's in this bag Nice. It's snacks. <laughs> Just a whole bunch of snacks. <laughs> That's Dalvin's bag. Okay. So, what if we put does this? See, yeah, it's leaking. I can't put it like that. So that's not gonna work. all wet now okay so let's keep this over here I need to find something to put in here Yeah, this is all leaking. 
So that's great. These are little sticky things to catch the bugs in the garage. Not like we have bugs. <laughs> Not like that. I don't know. I'm going to have to figure something out for this bin. I don't have nothing in here. Throw this out. Put this. I guess I can put like this kind of stuff in here. Like this is OxyClean for stains. Let's check it out. <laughs> All right, this is what we're working with so far. I think it looks nice and organized. Hmm. This is just my tanning lotions and whatever. Hold on. Okay guys, so I guess this is it for this video. I'm sorry that it's so short. I really thought I can do like more stuff with it, but there's really nothing else that I can organize that's in here, so... I guess I'm going to leave it off here. I'll explain everything to you guys real quick. So basically we have, I organized the laundry detergent right here. I put the beads in there and then the stuff is behind it. This has the fabric softeners. There is just all Swiffer stuff. More of Delvin's laundry detergent. This basket's going to be just miscellaneous for right now until I can figure out what else to put in there. And that is some car stuff. So, that's our laundry room. Pretty basic. <laughs> Nothing really in here, but I tried. I tried. I'm just trying to knock out videos, and I think you guys are crooked. And, you know, just do something different. So, if you guys want to see more organization videos, please smash the like button on this right here and leave a comment down below. Maybe give me some suggestions on what else I can do with the laundry room. Um, I know I can, like, hang up pictures and stuff, but we're going to be moving pretty soon. Well, I am. We're, we'll, you know, we're going our separate ways, so I don't think... You know, I should like decorate anymore. I just basically bought those things for video purposes. <laughs> well, I meant to do it, you know, like oh, as soon as we moved in, but I just couldn't show you guys anything. So here I am all excited to do organizing videos and it's like the last couple of months, but I know my true supporters will watch this video throughout the whole thing and leave some amazing comments. I hope you guys Stay blessed, stay, stay, stay safe out there, and you know where you can follow me on Instagram and Nicole, of course, and on Snapchat, Twitter, TikTok, and Facebook. It's Nicole, of course, with two E's at the end. Uh, yeah, I'm going to end off here. I'll see you guys tomorrow. I love everybody. I love you, 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 and you. Bye, guys.